The Brain Corporation is now implementing this technology in our real world. So the autonomous driving technologies uh, combined with deep learning and also AI so that uh, you can conduct safe and cheap uh, cleanings uh, without depending on the uh, human resources so that the uh, Brain Corporation is providing the brain for this cleaning machine. Thank you. Thank you. Let's talk about the future, the future that we all share. Uh, we all know that in the future, there will be robots everywhere, in your home, um, doing landscaping outside, in the farm, doing agriculture, uh, cleaning, uh, taking care of us, taking care of our parents, taking care of us. Now, it might be a surprise to many of you that all those future robots already exist today. They're made by thousands of OEMs. They're sold to practically every market out there. They probably were used today during the night to clean this room. Now, the reason we don't treat those devices as robots because they all require people to operate. And cost of labor is 90% of cost of operation of those machines. There's absolutely no reason for people to be there. In fact, it's not scalable if you have to assign a person to every robot. But the reason the people are there because those robots don't have brains. What if, what if they have a brain? This is exactly what Brain Corporation is doing. We're building brains for robots. AI in a box and in a cloud. We can take any vehicle that has wheels and soon legs. We can convert it into autonomous robot. Now, instead of waiting for the uh, self-driving cars and regulations to happen, uh, this future, future of self-driving is already here. In fact, it was here uh, last year. This is a cleaning machine. It has a brain. It's fully autonomous. It can navigate in this environment. It obstacles, people, children, um, get new uh, boxes and during restocking. Uh, it can navigate in very narrow spaces. It can squeeze between uh, different obstacles without ever getting in contact with them, without ever touching anything, without ever damaging anything. This machine with the brain is safer than a machine driven by a person. It's doing the job better, more consistent, and it's scalable. And it's cheaper for the, for the um, customer to operate this machine. This is a self-driving technology today in this kind of environment, in indoor environment. Now, we don't build the machine, we only build the brain. The way we operate is uh, we, we software company, we AI company. We partner with OEM partners, with manufacturers, who, which manufacture manual machines, and we provide them our technology. We teach them how to embed AI and, and the brain inside their manual vehicles, such that their vehicles become robot ready, autonomous. Our partners can sell uh, these vehicles to, to their customers. And the customers need to activate autonomy, activate AI. And uh, this is how we charge them. This is a, a SaaS business model. We charge them for AI as a service. Now, uh, right now we have uh, vehicles, commercial cleaning vehicles, but you can attach the brain to anything else that has wheels. It could be a delivery robot, it could be security patrol robot, could be autonomous wheelchair, could be anything, just it's only bounded by your imagination and finding the right partner who already making manual machine that does the job. So uh, today we're talking about commercial robots. Tomorrow, taking advantage of our relationship with, so, uh, with the SoftBank and with Qualcomm, uh, we're gonna cost down this technology to make it so inexpensive that we can put it into consumer robots. It will take care of us. Thank you. Fantastic, fantastic. Thank you, thank you.